Hello Lolas, welcome back to my channel. Guys, I know it's been a few days. I am here to show you guys a part of my haul. I can't, I'm not gonna like load everything in, but I wanted to show you a couple items that I've gotten for um, some of the babies that I am expecting um, to my girl and my boy. Um, but guys, if you're not subscribed to this channel, go ahead and smash that subscribe button. Click the bell to be a part of the notification squad. And don't forget, when you get done watching this video, give this video a thumbs up. Leave me a comment. And also go check out the giveaway video because today will be the last day for anyone to enter. Of course, you can always join the chatterbox and join in on that um, side of the world if you want to support my channel and so on and so forth um, but the entries the cutoff period will be today so everybody that joined from today and back um, has an opportunity to win a um, painted Gabigail by me I'm not going to get too far into that I just wanted to remind you guys in case you hadn't joined um, but right now i'm gonna see if i can get over here now keep in mind i know it's very dark in here my this particular room does not have a lot of lighting which of course usually my special babies are in here and um so i'll probably hardly ever record in here and it's like pitch black outside so that didn't help but this is the only time i have to make this video so i'm gonna attempt to go over on this other side so that i can See what you guys can see and um, show you guys some of the stuff that I have. So I haven't been nesting a whole lot for my boy, but I have a few things. So I'm going to start with the boy stuff first, I guess, and then I'll go to the girl stuff. So some of you guys that watch my shopping video knew that I had picked this up at um, Bye Bye Baby. And it's just a little me. Um, nightgown with a little hat I usually like to put them on little stuff like this like when they just get home and stuff because I can still keep peeking at their little legs and stuff and yeah so that is that this is a zero to three month it's pretty big though so I don't know how that will work and that's you know with yellow you can always put it on a girl or a boy but that's gonna be the boy Sometimes I buy stuff for myself and then I put it in a box opener. So don't be surprised if one or two things might not make it on my babies. But I really, you guys know how much I love elephants. So I had to get this as well with the little elephants on the hat. It's just simple, but I love anything that gives me that side snap. And it has a, you know, it's bird bees. It has a nice little texture to the shirt. So, I thought that would be cute. You know, just a little elephant pants, something to sleep around in. I tried this on Aspen, but it was too big. So, I have put it back for my next boy. And this is the, I think it's like what, is that the muslin um, shorts? kind of like and then it has the little shirt onesie and the the little bibby here and I got that from Marshalls I shop a lot at Marshalls and then I got this little outfit which is you know Disney Monday is always nice it says awesome um I don't know if you guys still do Disney Monday but I remember uh, my friend Crystal had actually started Disney Mon Monday years ago and we used to do that so I'm gonna probably get back try to get back into it so that's that um then I got this it's for Phoenix but I, I showed it because I got the matching little outfit for the little baby so Phoenix can match and I did the same thing with this little sleeper I think um, I think Phoenix outfit is a two part. 
And so I shop a lot at H&M and Carter's and Marshall's. Um, I used to shop at Ross, but I can't. they don't have much in my store no more. So I don't really even go in there. Um, yeah, so this, so for the big boy, oh man, my battery's going dead. It has the pants and bottom. So that's for Phoenix, my toddler. But this is an actual sleeper. I'm pretty sure this is just a sleeper. And I think I got this from Carter's. Yeah, so this is an actual sleeper with the feet. The feet out. I love sleepers with feet out. Absolutely love sleepers with feet out. Um, any Anything that I can show more of the actual doll itself um, is a plus for me. Because I like to look at the details, the sculpting, the painting, whatever, on the baby, usually. Um, okay, so now we're going to go into the girl stuff. That's it. I do have some other boy stuff, but it's like little stuff for um, one of my smaller boys. And it's not nothing worth really showing um, too much. But it's just some sleepers and stuff like that from Carter's. Um, and onesies and stuff. I even got some from Walmart. Um, but those were gifted to me. But this is, um, this is for my girl. So, I love girls in blue. So, I was like... She's definitely going to be cute in some soft blue and yellow. So the lemons, a little romper. Hopefully it don't be too big. Um, so I'm excited about that. Then I matched her with my grandbaby's <laughs> outfit because I bought my grandbaby one. And I was like, oh, she got to have one too. So it's got the little gold, little bloomers, you know, little shorts. And then it has the onesie. I should have got the matching socks. I'm going to go back and get the socks. But anyway, um, it has the little onesie. So she can either wear the onesie with it or this or by itself. You guys know the drill. This, I didn't mean to leave this over here. But this is for one of my bigger girls. So it would either go on Sasha or Maggie or one of those. And I thought that was so cute. I saw that at Marshall's and I had to get it. It's got like the eyelet type. Thing going on and it's kind of sheer and it's Disney so again um, some Jamie K um, stuff little floral um, wraps I love the little uh, wrap tops so I like that got her some sun hats because you know sometimes my babies be bald first <laughs> Um, so I decided, let me get some hats just in case. Um, but I'm pretty sure she'll have hair. But yeah, so those are just, you know, some of the prints, the hats. So I love that. Then I have, this is like a little romper with a um, cover up. So it's got a long sleeve cover up because when I, I was expecting her more during the cold months, but it's just so much. So it's warming up. So either way, she could still wear this without the um, cover up or with the cover up. So, because it is getting warm. Some days, some days it's still cool. So, and some days it's like 80 degrees here. So, and then I got some more little bloomers. I'm going to match up with a little top. And I have little stretch pants. Again, I'll probably match up with some tops that I already have. Because I do have a drawer full of stuff that I bought secondhand from, um... Amelia's closet and it's like a whole drawer full so I didn't wasn't gonna bring all that out of course and then um she has this little dress so it's kind of like a little knit dress and a little detail back there 
and she can wear it by itself or with some little tights um these are summer socks like and i think i showed you guys this little dress i have a blanket that matches this i see it laying back and it's got the little you know decor up here buttons down in the back and then I got another little dress, which is a little bit more thin. And I definitely think she will wear tights with these. This one. This one definitely needs tights. Um, I've been carrying this outfit forever. I know you guys probably seen this. Where is the pants? Oh, I didn't put the pants over here. But anyway, you guys, I've been waiting for a special baby to for this one. I've had it for a long time now, probably a year. And it says, hello, I'm new here might be one of the first outfits <laughs> that um, she wears just because. And then I have the 2021. Of course, those little outfits are always cute. And then I have, I'm trying to hurry up. I have a little uh, purple onesie. Um, I did get her some of the bubble rompers. Um, with the smocking um, as well as the the prototype babies and then I these little shirts like just a little shirt you know to match up with other stuff I did buy her some shoes and you know I have other shoes but I like these these were kind of lacy to maybe go with the bubble rompers <coughs> sorry I've been moving stuff around. Probably need to dust in here. No worries, guys. I am not dealing with anything major. <laughs> now we're in this COVID climate. You can't sneeze, you can't cough, you can't do nothing. Everybody's like, oh, she got it. Um, of course, I, I got these pacifiers, and I really like them because they have a really small... Um, nipple teat whatever they call it um so i got her some of those um and these and these i just wanted her to have some you know small ones oh here go the pants to that here go the pants to the um the one outfit I've been waiting just to, for a special baby. It's got bunny rabbits on it. So it's perfect anyway because maybe she'll be ready for Easter. I don't know because I don't know how fast Easter comes. I don't know. But I bought these socks off of Amazon and I was kind of a little disappointed. Oh, I don't know what a match to this is right now. But I have these little socks too. And I have these little socks. I like the newborn -y socks. These are socks that they usually wear from the hospital. But... I bought these socks and I didn't think that these bows was going to be like velvety, but I'm realizing that that's kind of style right now too. So I was like, I was going to send them back and I decided to keep them, but I wanted some long socks. So she has different colors. Like I said, I was expecting maybe um, cooler months. So I was thinking long socks, long socks, but you know. We still do it in the summer or whatever. Um, so, yeah. So, I got those different colors. And then I got these. I got these socks as well. I'll show you what one of them look like. So, they're just little. Yeah. So, I got all the little. All the little tiny little things. Of course, you guys know I got special little diapers that I want her to be able to wear different prints and stuff like that. I already have her bracelet ready. So, that is it, guys. So, I hope you enjoyed the little haul. But, like I said, it's just some of the stuff that I got that I was like, okay, I'll pull this out because it's right here. Because I have, like, um some drawers in my room that's for my babies usually my special baby stuff 
So I was like, I, I can easily put it back up. Um, also, oh guys, the most important thing. I actually, for those that watch me shop live on Facebook and um, on my video, I did end up going with the Chico bassinet thingy. And it does, um, oh, it lets all the way down, but it also lets all the way up to my height, which I love. Also, um, let me see. I don't, I'm still learning how to do it. I think so. Also, this folds all the way down and becomes a bassinet. I mean, not a, a changing table. Um, and then back to the bassinet. But yeah, so I like it up high, but it it matches my room. So I'm gonna see if I can pull back so you guys can see a little bit. It has a vibrator, music, light. Um, wait. Oh, maybe I ran the battery dead. Oh, oh no, I didn't. So it has, and you can turn it up, down, whatever, whatever. But um, I mainly got it because I like it. I mainly got it because it actually, in my opinion, um, it just for my back and stuff and just, it just, I thought it looked cool in my room. So I like the way it looked in here. So let me see. So it's, it has that kind of stand. You can see all my lights that I'm using. So it has that kind of stand and then it, it's like that but it's it's really cool it's basic it's not really nothing fancy so to speak it was quite expensive but i used my coupon i got it from bye bye baby um it was like um 3.99 399 something like that but i had a coupon for 20 percent off i think and something else i don't know but i so I use a coupon and it took it down a lot. So it was pretty cool. So I, yeah, so that's that. And thanks guys again once for watching and we should hopefully have babies soon. Um, so yeah, well, I don't know. Maybe, I don't know how long, much longer on the boy, but um, yeah, cause I don't, I probably won't share my boy until he's fully rooted and everything and stuff. So, whew, so much, so much to do. Talk to you guys later in the next video. Bye.